guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I have a giveaway for you today, so I'm pretty excited about this. If you are new to my channel, every single quarter I do a Disney mystery box giveaway, and it is winter of 2018, so it's a new quarter, and it's time for me to do a new mystery box giveaway. The purpose of this giveaway is really just for me to say thank you to all of you for supporting my little Disney corner of the internet. I've met so many incredible people from this channel. I've got a really fun like Facebook community going now. And it's just been like such an incredible journey since I joined YouTube last May. And I wanna make sure that I'm finding ways as often as possible to say a sincere thank you and to give back. And the other reason for this giveaway is I often get questions from you guys about where I store and keep all of my Disney items because if you've been around for a little bit you know I do do a lot of Disney hauls and Disney mystery box unboxings and the truth is I actually keep quite a few of my Disney items I've got them set aside for different seasons and different holidays and I've got things in drawers and things in closets but I do have a limited amount of space and I do have a limited amount of attention so I also try to occasionally call my collection and I'll often donate toys and things to um, shelters but I also like to pull out a few things once per quarter and put them all in a big box and give them to you for this giveaway. So if you're wondering how I manage all of my Disney things and not turn into a total Disney hoarder, this is one of the ways that I like to do that. So I will tell you in a moment how you can enter to win. It will be very easy. But first, I want to show you all of the things that I have put in the magical mystery Disney kitty giveaway box for you. And I'm just gonna kind of go through them one by one. Some of them might be familiar because I've unboxed them in the last few months. And some of them I actually picked out just for you you guys so I hope you like what's in here and I'm excited to offer it up to to one of you so let's get going okay so the first thing I'm pulling out of my magical mystery box is this really beautiful snow white mirror I actually bought uh, one of these for myself I actually bought a handful of these um, they went on sale after the holidays I'm the biggest snow white fan and snow white recently had its 80th anniversary and I'm just I think this is one of the most beautiful pieces of merchandise that they came out with so here it is it is a beautiful gold snow white mirror you can see her silhouette with the apple on the back and of course the mirror on the front side like you can look out my bedroom window right now and the mirror actually tucks into this really beautiful little case that is shaped like an apple and on the front of the case it says Disney art of snow white and it's kind of beautifully embossed in gold I also really like that the mirror has this kind of apple stem attached to it with a little um, gold hardware at the end of it if you've been around my channel for a while, you'll know that this is actually a pretty special item for me. Snow White is my favorite Disney princess, and I talk about her all the time, so I don't know, I just thought this would be a nice thing to throw into this giveaway so that you could be reminded of me and how much I love Disney and how much I love Snow White. Item number two in my mystery box is actually a cookbook, and it's actually a really freaking cool cookbook. It is the Best of Epcot Festivals cookbook. So presumably it has recipes from the booths at the Food and Wine Festival and the Flower and Garden Festival. I love that it not only has recipes, but it has full color photographs of the dishes as well as some beautiful full color photos that were taken inside of Epcot at Disney World. My husband and I love to cook and it's a little bit challenging for me to let go of this, but honestly we have hundreds of cookbooks in our personal cooking library and we are actually trying to downsize those a little bit. So I thought this would be a perfect thing to gift to one of you. Next up inside of here, I have something that is kind of kitchen related. Let me open it. This is actually a set of four different coasters. They come in this little Mickey Mouse holder. They're super solid and they feature Mickey, Pluto, Donald, and Goofy. So four of the Fab Five. And honestly, with these, I really wanted to keep these and I was kind of campaigning to put this out in our house and my husband just vetoed it. He was like, you know, we've got a lot of coaster sets and Disney is taking over my life. Can we just not have Disney on the coasters um, in our dining space? And I was like, okay, sweetie. <laughs> um, so even though I really like these, they are going back into this uh, packaging and being shipped off to one of you and hopefully your spouse or your person will allow you to display them, unlike mine who is incredibly patient with me, but this was like, this was a line for him, obviously. Next up I have this Thermosy tumbler. I actually received this in my Disney Funko Pop subscription. And it's a really cute little mini thermos and it features Mickey and Minnie and they are ice skating together. The top unscrews and it looks really solid and well made on the inside and I'm assuming this will probably keep your drinks quite warm or also quite cold if you're into cold, which is what I'm into. 
So I will be including this in your mystery box as I already have more than enough Disney things to drink out of as my spouse kindly always reminds me. <laughs> Okay, I think this is the final kitchen-y thing in this giveaway, but it is a cookie cutter. It is an Olaf from Frozen Cookie Cutter. So there's the packaging. This actually also came out of that Funko Pop box, and it's uh, in promotion for Olaf's Frozen Adventure, the short film that came out with Coco. And there's just a really cute little Olaf-shaped cookie cutter. And honestly, I don't do a ton of baking. I haven't made cookies that involved cookie cutters in, in many years, so that's why I'm gonna let this one go, let it go. Get it? Let it go. Next up I have a Disney Showcase Collection figurine by the artist Brito. And I believe this one is of Goofy. I have so many Disney figures and pops and figurines that it's hard for me to keep track of them all. So let me make sure that this is the one I'm thinking of. Oh yeah, so here he is. This is Goofy. He's doing a little silly dance and it actually says LOL on the figure. Um, so it's bright and colorful and cheerful. And I like this because it reminds me of Goofy's laugh, which just kills me. Heel, 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 heel. I always say that Donald is my favorite of the Fab Five, but whenever I go to the parks, I always want to meet Goofy because he's such a fun and hilarious meet and greet. So maybe Goofy's actually my favorite. I don't know. I may need to reconsider my, my thoughts on that. In any case, Goofy will be making his way to one of you in my mystery box. Valentine's Day is coming up. I actually really love Valentine's Day, and I have a couple little Valentine's-ish things that I'm gonna include in this box. The first one is something that I actually mentioned on my channel a couple days ago. These are the Disney Tsum Tsum Valentine's Day buttons. You can actually get these at Walgreens, and so this is a pack of 12, and you can keep them all for yourself, or you can break them up and give them to your friends, because it says to and from on the back. And here's just a close-up of some of the cute little characters. These are so adorable. I bought several of these. I'm gonna be putting some on my pin board. I'm gonna be giving some away to friends. And obviously I'm giving this one away to you. When I think of Valentine's Day, I think of sending love letters or appreciation letters in the mail. So I'm including this little Tsum Tsum Disney stationery set. It has stationery, paper, it has letter paper, envelopes, look at how cute the envelopes are, and it also has a whole sheet of stickers, and I love stickers, so um, this is awesome, this is going into the box. And I'm also including this lip smackers, so you can have good kisses on Valentine's Day. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. Actually, funny story about this, my friend Lindsay, her channel is called Ears to Mickey, I'll link to her down below. Um, she actually sent me this as part of my Christmas present, um, which is great, because it's awesome. And then, like, three more people gave this to me. And there's, they come in all different characters, but every single person gave me the same one, the Minnie Mouse one. So I have, like, four of these now, um, which is great because it's adorable and it's awesome. But I think I can spare at least one of them for you guys so that you can have some good smooching for, for Valentine's season. I don't know. That's kind of a dorky thing to say, and I'm, I'm half kidding. But, um, but that's the story with this. She's super adorable. Like, seriously, so, so cute. The next thing I'm coming up with is directly from the Disney Parks, and it is this Happy Birthday Mickey Mouse button from his 2017 birthday celebration. You had to be in Disney World to get this, and actually this was mailed to me by my friend Ashley. She sent me two, one for me and one for you guys. Here's a cute close-up, just really fun Disney Parks memorabilia. It would totally make my day if the person who won this giveaway had a birthday coming up, but, um, but we'll see. Even if it's not your birthday, you can still win. Okay, the next thing is something I showed a couple days ago. This is a Snow White Ufufi. Um, Ufufis are kind of the latest Disney collectible craze. There was Tsum Tsums for a long time, and now it's these cute little round Ufufi characters. Um, and this is the Snow White one. She smells like apple blossoms. I'm still kind of, I like, it's a pleasant smell, but it doesn't smell like apple blossoms to me. I don't know what it smells like. It's pleasant though. And I actually have a matching one. She's up there behind me um, in front of that pillow on my shelves. So I'm passing on this one to you guys and we can be Snow White Ufufi twins. There are two items left in this giveaway. One of them I actually have with me, so I will show it to you right now. The other one, I'm just gonna have to show you a picture of it, and you can take my word that I'm gonna add it to the box after I get back from my Disney trip uh, next week, and I'll tell you what that is in just a second. But the last thing I have to show you is actually my favorite, favorite item in this giveaway, and I like wrestled with myself about giving this away because it's really cool. It is this really cool Walt Disney World tote that is also a backpack. It's a tote and it's a backpack, and it's a tote, 
and it's a backpack. It's really cool. Um, it's actually incredibly spacious and roomy. It's got like an extra pocket on the side and some extra pockets on the inside as well. It's perfect for taking around the parks or just taking around your life. If you're in school, it'd be a great bag to take to school because it would fit like 10 million books in here. Um, it's really, really awesome. And I received this in one of my recent mystery boxes. This came in Magic at Your Door, and I love Magic at Your Door. And honestly, I was going to take this to Disney World with me next week. But as I was packing, I was looking around at all of the Disney bags that I already have. Like seriously, I have so many of these that it's not really even funny, and I could go on and on actually. And I just thought, okay, I need to share the wealth of Disney tote bags. So I am gonna throw this bag into this giveaway, even though I think it's awesome and I think it would have looked really cute on me in the parks. I wanna give someone else a chance because I really have more bags than I can even pack or use or fit into a suitcase. So this is going into my giveaway and I'm giving it a big hug um, because it's pretty awesome and it was hard for me to let this one go. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, and last, but definitely not least, I am going to include a Rice Krispie Treat from Walt Disney World in this box. The Rice Krispie Treats at Walt Disney World are very special. I don't know what they do to them. I don't know if they sprinkle them with pixie dust. I don't know if they just get their like crispy to marshmallow ratio perfect. But that is my favorite, favorite treat at Disney World. I always bring a couple home with me so that I can like snack on them in between trips and and remember the magic through food. Um, but I'm gonna bring home one of my favorite Rice Krispie treats ever on the planet for you guys and stick it in that box and send it off to you. So I don't have it with me now. Um, there's just no way I could have it in my house for very long and not eat it myself. But I will be picking up one in the parks for this giveaway and I will be putting it in there and sending it off to you. So if you've never had a Disney Rice Krispie treat, get excited because I'm not even a Rice Krispie Treat person, except for these ones. They are ridiculous. If you would like to win my winter mystery box, it is very easy to enter. All you have to do is be a subscriber to my channel, so hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up or a like, and leave a comment down below answering this question. Now the question, I just wanna tell you, it was inspired by a discussion that's been happening on my Facebook group, and I don't know if this is gonna be a controversial question, but I'm actually just really curious to know. The question for this giveaway is, what is your least favorite Disney movie? <gasps> Blasphemous, I know, but I, I'm really super curious. Try not to bash movies in the comments, but I really would like to know like, which is your least favorite movie? And if you wanna share why in a, in a constructive family, appropriate way. Um, I'd also love to know why. I'm just, I'm always really curious. There's been a really interesting discussion on my Facebook group about it and people's answers have shocked and surprised me. So it's my own morbid curiosity that, that wants to know. So to enter, you just be a subscriber, hit like, and leave a comment down below. What's your least favorite Disney movie? And you could also share why. And I would be very curious to, to find out. If you'd like to get a bonus entry, you can also head on over to my Instagram account, which is just Disney Kitty on Instagram. And whatever the most recent photo Photo is give it a like and leave a comment letting me know that you're from YouTube and what your YouTube username is so I can match you up and make sure you get um, double entries uh, into this contest and since I am headed off to Walt Disney World for next week this contest is open until midnight Eastern Standard Time on Thursday February 8th so you've got a little bit of time to enter I'm gonna leave it open and make sure I get back from Disney with your Rice Krispie treat and get all situated and then um, I'll pick a winner I'm not sure if I'm gonna do a separate video to an Announce the winner or if I'm just going to message the person privately I haven't quite decided yet because um, sometimes messaging people privately hasn't worked out for me in the past so I might just make like an announcement video when it's over um, but anyway you have until February 8th if you're under 18 years old please have your parents permission to enter because obviously I'm going to need to get your address if you win the prize to, to send it to you um, this giveaway is open internationally so anywhere in the world you can enter and you're eligible to win and anything else that you might want to know in terms of rules or details about this giveaway are all going to be listed in the info box down below and speaking of my video description box by the way people are always asking in the comments where I get my ears and sometimes my t-shirts and if that's something 
something that's available like on Etsy, I always leave the information down in the info box below so you can always look there. And for the record, these are actually Disney Parks rose gold ears. These were mailed to me by a subscriber, Amanda. Thanks, Amanda, if you're watching. And I have to show you my cute tank top. This is a really fancy Snow White tank top that also came from the Disney Parks. And this was sent to me by my friend Daphne, who has a channel called Thomas Ever After, a really cute Disney YouTube channel. So I will link to her down below as well. Whew. Okay, I think my work is done here. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enter. If you're new to my channel, thanks for finding me. And um, I'll see you guys really soon. Like I said, I'm headed to Disney World. I'm gonna get some short little like daily dose of Disney up for you guys during my trip, I hope. And I might have one more video coming up before my trip. I'm not totally sure if it's gonna happen, um, but I'll probably see you Tuesday or Wednesday of next week one way or, or the other. So have a magical day and I hope I'm gonna see you real soon. Bye. Bye.